Hey there, DC. Uh, this is Tim Cannon from Grindhouse Wetwares. Uh, first of all, I wanted to thank you for being uh, an early commenter on the Grindhouse blog and grind on my channel as well. Um, as far as project updates and stuff like that, I'll make sure that the next blog post that we have uh, includes, you know, project timelines, things of that nature, uh, so on and so forth. Uh, however, the question I did want to answer for you was how to find people in your area that um, might do implants for you and if we have an active list. Um, now as far as the active list, we want to get a Google Doc going that's like public and then you can request permission to kind of edit it, add a, add a uh, name to that and, and, and that sort of thing. Um, <coughs> however, we want to make sure that people can't just add names without being vetted. You know, we want to call those piercers and make sure that they're okay with being posted up there because there are goofy state laws and then some people choose to buck those laws and of course we encourage that. Um, now as far as finding somebody in your town, uh, I can tell you what I did. What I did was I happened to know somebody who did tattoos at Black Cat Tattoos in Pittsburgh and I called her and said, you know, do you know anybody who does any extreme piercing in the area or uh, implant work? And uh, she said, you know, I only really know one guy who's even interested in that sort of stuff, and it's Tim from Hot Rod Piercing. And so I went and spoke with Tim and explained what I wanted and um, <coughs> that sort of thing. And, you know, the rest is history. We came up with an implant procedure. Uh, he's since talked to Steve Hayworth and improved that implant procedure. So, uh, but, um, so my recommendation would be to call around, if you're not plugged into that community, if you're not, you know, all, um, you know, into body modification, that sort of thing, uh, call a tattoo shop, or if you can, better yet, call a piercing shop and uh, talk to somebody there and just explain what it is that you're looking for and either they'll be able to do what you're looking for or they'll be able to point you in the right direction. Um, again, w this is one of these things where risks involved. So you want to go to body modification forums and see if you can find ways of getting reviews on the professionalism of piercers and that sort of thing, so that you can make sure that you're you're getting a good guy. Uh, as far as doing it yourself, some of our members have, but I don't recommend it. Uh, it's definitely something that you don't want to take lightly. Uh, you can do nerve damage. One of our members actually did do nerve damage uh, to themselves and, and consequently when me and him got together and we went to go start hunting down magnetic fields, uh, we were startled by um, how different his versus mine was. So uh, just simply for the performance metric, I always recommend going to a piercer or a professional like that that's kind of used to that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, so that's what I did and I hope that helps. And uh, like I said, we'll give you some updates in blog posts uh, coming from the Grindhouse blog on projected timelines and things like that. Uh, a lot of stuff's cooking in the kitchen and um, we're trying to kind of uh, get everything as, as, as organized as possible so that we can get some releases out again. Alright, thanks.